Welcome to Butte Haven's first ever virtual sports day. I'm Olivia, I'm from Year 7 and I'm going to show you what you need to do. There are six different challenges you can do. Three of them are practical and three of them are cultural challenges. I'm going to show you how to do each You can one. choose to do however many challenges you want, but just remember to submit your entries via the form sent to you. Challenge number one is the standing board jump. To do this you'll need two things you can use to mark out the start and end of where you jump and you also need a flat surface that you're not going to slip. This is what you need to do. Set down your first marker and make sure your feet are in line. Then get momentum by swinging your hands and do three jumps like this. And then place the marker at the back of your foot. Find out how many points you've got and use your feet to measure out your distance. Make sure your heels are always touching your toes. I got 19 feet and that's what I put on my You can have three attempts at this challenge and you take your best goal forward. Challenge number two is the rounders keep your uppies. To do this you need a bat and a ball. If you haven't got this be creative and use something like a Pringles tube or a rolling pin or for the ball a pair of rolled up socks. You're going to see how many keepy uppies you can do in a minute. Um, ideally you can have someone else to time a minute for you but if you don't set an alarm on your phone and you'll go up. If you drop the ball you go back to zero but you take through the highest score that you got in a minute. Start the timer. Ready, steady, go. Four. Four is still your highest. Five. Six. Six. And time's up. Six was my highest score and that's what I'll put on the Challenge floor. number three is the hopping speed bounce. All you need to do this is a flat surface that you won't slip on and an obstacle to jump. Now I'm going to demonstrate what you're going to do. Choose your preferred leg to stand on and see how many hops you can do in 30 seconds. Again, try to get someone else to time for you, but if you can't set an alarm on your On your marks, get set, go. One, two, three, four, 21, Five. 22, time. 22 is my score and that's what I'll put forward for the Just four. like the previous two challenges, you get three attempts at this challenge and you take your high score forward. Now for the cultural challenges. Challenge number four is to design a banner. It would be really great if you can incorporate your house and its values into this design. It can be any size you like, A4, smaller or bigger. Be really creative with your design. Once you're done, take a picture of your design and enter it on Show My Homework. Challenge number five is to write a sporting story. It needs to be a minimum of 400 words and you need to submit your entries via Show My Homework. This story can be factual or fictional and get creative with what you're writing. Challenge number six is a photography challenge. To do this, you just need to take a photo of some sports equipment or perhaps a member of your family or friends doing some sports. You can really take a picture of whatever you like as long as it revolves around sports. Once you've done this make sure to submit your entries on Show My Home. You have one day to get as many of these challenges done as possible and you have until 5 o'clock on Wednesday the 22nd of July to get them entered. Good luck and have lots of fun!